On this very cold day, you can escape to a playland made of tape. That's right. A popular exhibit is back in St. Louis. This time, it can be found at the St. Louis Public Library Central Library. And perhaps best of all, it's free. Allow me to take you inside. A new use for tape has taken shape on the third floor of Central Library in downtown St. Louis. It's basically a structure that's made out of packing tape. It's pretty bouncy, super slidey. I've never seen anything made out of tape. This indoor playground of sorts called Tapescape seems to be the best escape for this group of 10 year olds. I think it's really cool and a fun place for kids to get their energy out. Just don't go too crazy, because then you might break a bone. Tapescape was the idea of Minnesota-based artist Eric Lenartson, who took the stuff used to seal packages and thought outside the box. Now his tapescapes are built all over the world, taking different forms everywhere it goes. And everywhere it goes, kids are blown away. I thought like it's gonna be like sticky and like, I, I thought I wasn't going to be able to move. This tape art isn't the least bit sticky, but surprisingly strong. I thought it would probably break because we're wild and crazy, but it doesn't break. It holds up pretty good. There's just two rules with tapescape. No shoes, you have to wear socks. And with that, adults and kids can come play. The young and the young at heart, it basically can hold anyone. Dozens of volunteers spent four days putting the structure together. It took a few metal poles and more than 39,000 feet of packing tape. That's seven and a half miles worth. And like all art, there's more than meets the eye. Science, technology, engineering, art, and math, for example. It introduces them to architecture and lets them know that architecture isn't just about straight lines and shapes, but it can be anything. Tapescape is open from 10 to 5 Monday through Saturday at the Central Library. That's 1301 Olive Street in downtown St. Louis.